gave me so much more word. And guess what? I had my office. I was like, hold up. I, I thought of you. Let me record this. We was walking. We yes, I'm glad you wife. did that. <laughs> and, and, man, I had to let him listen to the, the, the thing you just that we put on there about Faith Jam and talking about the region and all that. Mm. Man, you doing everything you're supposed to be doing, bro. Mm. Don't let nobody get you off course, man. You, you being obedient to the Spirit of God. Everything you've been saying the Spirit had you do, you keep doing it, man, because you're doing exactly what God wants you to be doing. I can tell you that for real. Wow. Don't let nobody, you know, nobody come between me and you, man. We, 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 the power of two agreement, man. God is right, so. I told you I heard St. Jam being yelled out twice. Mm, yep, yep. Twice for two weeks, though. Three weeks. That, that was the, the, yeah, the three weeks. That wasn't the enemy. That was God. Because God. I know. God was doing some stuff. He was yeah. doing some stuff, and he made sure you knew who to be connected to and which, which way to run. Boom, boom, boom. That's why I said you coming out. And it's like, man, you want to find more than I've ever seen you before. And, uh, but this word I got, Matthew, I can't even tell you some of it. But <laughs> don't you know that I had to show the brother, you know the videos you made? Yes. The, me talking about the region and boom, boom, boom. Yes, sir. It was like he said exactly what I said. I said, man, I was like, good God Almighty. Let me mm. let you hear this. So I brought up, brought up the video you made and everything about us talking about the region, boom, boom, boom. I was like, man, it was like you said everything I've been saying. Mm. I had to let him listen to what he just prophetic. That's confirmation, of course. But the <laughs> youth and everything, us drawing the youth, the music, man. The reason, remember, what, why did I tell you I named my company production? Yes, yeah, Faith Jam. No, why did I say that the that it's not a record label, it's production? Why did I say Oh, that? oh, oh, because it won't just be record label. It'll be movies. It'll be uh, well, uh, uh, let me tell you, He confirmed all of that. I recorded it. Man. You did record it? I recorded it. But keep doing right. what you're doing, Matthew. Keep Addie Lips the show. Keep doing what you're doing, Faith Jam. We won, brother. Power two, man. Let me tell you something. I have a thing. I'm not just talking to you. I just got a confirmation to what we're about to do. It's about to go beyond our imagination. Let me tell you, don't let nobody. I don't care if you even know before me. Hear you is divine purpose, brother. Yes, sir. It's divine purpose. I don't care what <laughs> nobody tell you. Don't let nobody speak against fake jam and doing what I do. Because folks going to come and think they can take what we're about to do and do it. But you can't do it with somebody that ain't divine to do it. You, you know right that. So. Right, so. All right, bless you, man. I get in touch. Hey, bless you, sir. Sounds All right. good. Appreciate it. All right. M3Dots.com. God on radio. I become irresponsive to my feelings. I'm walking by decrees. Would it be am I decide of what a shell is what I see? It's hard to calculate the fullness and relate my faith and pull it in one definition. Put it like this. I've been work for many visions. Each one a mission. Full with provision to precision. To stick when I'm sitting to the harvest. Hawk and listen. Line up on line. We'll build this precept as we step in a familiar district. So get set and get this. It's not about the limelight or the check. <laughs> Dots dot radio. Tony, whoa, thank you for giving me a call. I didn't listen to the message. I just saw that you left a voicemail. Thank you. I just wanted to call you right back because I just got off the phone um, with other people. How are you doing, sir? Oh, man, I'm breathing. Uh, you can't ask for more than that. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. You can <laughs> ask for the kingdom. Seek ye first. What you talking about, as Listen, don't be living low now, okay? Don't be living but, low on the hog. Should I say, should I say that I, without breathing, I couldn't have anything else? Listen, so, listen, don't, listen, you ain't even got to go cliche on me either, okay? Now, you know what I'm saying? Listen, the, t- listen, I just want you to know, sir, that things are moving, and your the mission that I'm on has spiritual ramifications. In my in my life, okay, and maybe it's maybe I'm just a dummy, 
<laughs> you know, maybe I'm just a dummy. But you know, when 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 I started on this road, uh, Tony, um, I understood kingdom, and I always dealt with spiritual warfare. But it was always in the spirit. It was. It didn't really come in the, in the natural as much. You right. know what I'm saying? So when 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 the spirit realm start manifesting in the natural, it's like oh snap, oh I got to actually make some real, I got to make some real provisions. <laughs> this thing is real. Oh, oh, woo! Like you ever have you ever um actually to to a degree you have some of the stories that you gave me that you told me you have come to and, and saw behind the curtain behind the, the you know not the, but, but you, you know the, the booming voice but the small frail person behind the curtain you ever done that <laughs> yeah. and then and then they manifest their insecurities on you like you wrong yeah so i want you to know this thing has real ramifications are you dealing with real ramifications, sir? Oh, yeah. How crazy this planet is. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm just I'm just praising God for the breath that's in my body. That's, that's the main thing that matters to me right now. He, he, you can't, know. Look, he can't stop you if, you if you're still breathing. That means you ain't stopped. Exactly. <laughs> What is, um, off the top of your head, do you feel, sir, that the uh, Chicago, the, I'm, I'm sorry, the Christian Rap Facebook pages, are they ready for me to stream through, or do I need to do something more to make that happen? Because if I'm ready, and I just have not tried it yet because I didn't know, um, like I'm right now. I'm at I'm at Christian Rap Las Vegas. Mm, I'm not sure. I, I, I like actually it. I actually have not been on them in the last couple of weeks. So I've been uh, actually shutting down a lot of the operation, trying to uh, streamline everything that we're doing. So, so okay. So thank you. See, that's what I'm talking about. So can you? Do, I, I, I won't have you explain everything now, but can you, how, how easy is it for you to email me or do a voice thing to me with that, with the details? Uh, mm, I don't know, that's pretty easy, I don't <laughs> so, so, Okay, so I, my, my, I have a pen of a ready writer. What things are, because you know what, it looks like I can do live on those pages. So what is being streamlined? What do I need? I'm writing it down right now. I got my notebook. Oh, as far as, well, streamline is, is, is mainly my stuff. I'm, uh, I've shut down the, uh, I've shut down my label in my production, um, production squad and, uh, and my radio show. And, uh, Basically, just concentrating on the uh, on the Tony Woe ministry side, you know, and uh, and music, the personal music and stuff, you know. So I, I won't have a label, and I won't be uh, producing the video show or the radio show and all that stuff anymore. So and so, and really, you're talking about time redemption. Yeah, pretty much. And that's, that's really good. Let me ask you a question. Because you did everything on YouTube, that stuff is still there, right? Yeah, it's, still, it's not visible, but it's still there. So if you can, if you can make it visible, no, it, in other words, it, uh, uh, let me say it's, it's not visible. It's unlisted. Yeah. Unlisted. But it, so in other words, if you can do me a favor – and make it so that I can see those, so that I can do some downloads of those, and then do some editing, because I can still make content 
from that. In other words, it's like, you know how you have reruns? Mm-hmm. The, yep. your, your content is still valuable, and that's what I want to do. I'll be able to listen to it, and I'll know which stuff is, you know, all right, that was specific thing, but you got some general principle stuff. Because when every time that I've heard it, I've been blessed by what you've been doing. It's, it's fantastic stuff. It's meaty, and I couldn't always get into it because of the season I was in. But now I'm able to record. I got all my studio stuff set up, and this is what I'm doing full time. Oh, cool. You know what I'm saying? So you, so so that, so now you shut the label down. So in other words, Fifth Eye Music. That was the label, right? Right. And so, uh, L.A. and Draft are the two people. What have they done wrong to you? Because <laughs> I always knew that you was so, it felt solo operation. Oh, they haven't done anything wrong. That's what I'm saying. It's so what, it's, uh, it's just a matter of what. Like Simple is my wife. But she she's on on hiatus because of the new job, so she right. can't do much of she can't do much of anything. Mm-hmm. And draft is, um, you know, he's in the middle of uh, getting planning his wedding, and he's changing his just moved to a new town and stuff, changing his whole life and stuff. Yeah. But um, like I was telling him before, even when I signed him, I was telling him, I'm like my, you know, my main goal is to make you independent. It's to get you. Yeah, you were training them up. Yeah, and and right now it's it's just that it's that point in time where I have to I have to focus my energies any in, any free time that I have needs to be on what God has me doing with Tony Wolf. Of course. I, yeah, I can't. Uh, you know, I still keep the family reunion up and going because it's pretty much for the most part, runs itself. But, um... When you say you know, family, uh, you talk about the website. You talk about the Facebook page. Yeah, yeah. Right. So those, so those are not stream. Those are not being streamlined. Those are still... Yeah, those are pretty much... Yeah. The, yeah. That's the same way. I, I t- listen, what God is doing with you on that, it lines up with what exactly... What, what I've been talking about with you. I think because those Facebook pages, I can stream through them jokers. You know what I'm saying? And I mm-hmm. and the thing about it is I'm getting different results. Um, uh, then I'm getting different results because I'm focusing on the stuff differently. So that to me, I'm proud of you. The radio show. What do you mean by radio show? Well, that what you see on YouTube was being yeah. streamed uh the audio was being uh played as part of uh umrradio.com's Wednesday night lineup right and so had, you had uh, to pay for that right or did they pay you no no they they were there wasn't no money involved in it at all mm-hmm. it was just they uh they had the platform and they loved what I was doing and they asked me if I'd be down so you gotcha. know, in the beginning, it was cool, but trying to do my time is just being cut short right now with yeah. uh, work and different things like that. So I know what God, I know what God is specifically. You know, the main, the number one thing on my list from Him is these lyrics and these songs. So come on now, come on now. I mean, it's finally time. That's yep. the thing. It's finally time because. I'm going to tell you something. You put in the work to bless everybody else. And so the foundation has been laid. I'm very proud of you, Tony Woe. You deserve a salute. (laughs) And I salute you, man of God, for doing the work to help establish the genre. And it is now time for you to eat the fruit of your labor. Okay? Okay. Yeah. That's, so I'm with you on this. You know, what you're saying is very, very on point. Please allow me not 
to take over anything you're doing, but let me know what things you need me to do because for lack of a better name, and if you give it a different name, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to align myself up with that name. The Tony Wo region, underneath the Tony Wo region is the Maddie Lipson district. And the district concept has so much in it. So it, in a region, you got several districts. You see what I'm saying? Your plan mm-hmm. is huge. And even though you ain't been, like, messing with it, like, the, the way that I've been messing with it, you're going to see that finally there are little things percolating that God's been doing. And I've been paying attention. I just haven't talked to you about all of it yet. So you laid the framework. It's time for you, yes, to go ahead and now establish the Tony Wolf name in the earth. Doggone it. <laughs> when do you want to come to Milwaukee? When do you want to come to Toma? When do you want to come to South Carolina? Let's get your calendar together so you ain't got to do the gas money tour. You can do the we already got the gas money. Oh, man, whenever, you know. I'm uh, Right now, I'm, like, wide open. So I okay. got uh, – that's Memorial good. Day, I'm doing uh, – well, there's a couple of things. I got Memorial Day, we're going to Mississippi for family. Um, and then I have a wedding in September that I'm emceeing. I don't, I don't know how I'm emceeing it, but <laughs> – uh, Listen, listen, it's called, it's called tailor-made. You just be there and yeah. you, just, you just – so, listen, what we have to do is synchronize uh, your calendar. Your itinerary. Have, have, when you do your itinerary, do you know the best one is uh, two things? Um, uh, Reverb Nation, their itinerary is good, as well as Eventbrite. So do you mm-hmm. ever use those, or what do you use for your itinerary? You just put the date on, on your website? No, I actually use um, Reverb Nation. If, yeah. you, if, you look, if you look at my website, the, the actual calendar space and map is yeah. from Reverb Nation. <laughs> exactly. And so, and I that's just the thing. it out there. And, so, and, the, and, see, and that's the thing. That was my requirement with all the rappers that was going to be a part of what we were doing. It was going to mm-hmm. be you need to have a Reverb Nation account. You don't pay the paid account because I already paid the paid account, and it doesn't do much. For you. I paid it for three months. Uh, Sonic Beard and Reverb Nation. I paid them, and and I got into all of the things that they offer in terms of shows, and none of them panned out. Yeah. None of them. Cause it's yeah, I tried it too. <laughs> yeah. So they just taking your money. So we use them for the um for the itinerary until until there is a new way that we'll do it, but that'll come in 2020 you know, with, with our apps or whatever. So Reverb Nation, what's good about Reverb Nation is when you and me do New Year's, which the date is it's going to be, it won't be exactly New Year's, like New Year's literally on the 20, you know, 39th or whatever, 30th, I'm sorry, 31st and 1st. In uh, uh, Apostle's parents, he said he might push it back to like Saturday, like a different part of it because they – his church, they do certain specific. So we can co- we can convene about that and talk a little bit more about that. But Reverb Nation enables me to say, add it to the event, re- uh, you know, Tony Wolf and Matthew Walker. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? That's what I love about it. Cause so the itinerary is full and it's perfect. So on my website, entrydust.com, I'm covering the whole genre of us. Do you know what I'm saying? Tony Wall yep. region, Maddie Lipson's district. You keep your website, but if you allow me to put the joint itinerary on yours, or I mean, obviously they'll have yours, you know, but on mine, I will have everybody's itinerary. You know what I'm saying? Because mine is basically, um, it's, a, it's a broadcasting network that will be broadcasting through those Chicago I'm sorry, through those Christian rap Facebook pages 
and mm-hmm. through the YouTube pages that or whatever, through the website, and then different markets that we plan to uh, integrate our music in. You, sir, you already have been doing it. And I'm grateful to God because your positioning right now, I couldn't ask for nothing better. And you're the right man to be, you're the right man to, to oversee what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? In terms, you know, obviously I'm, I'm feverish working on a bunch of stuff. So thank you. And I'm not going to take up too much more of your time right now, but um, this puts us in a scenario where the weekly call, it may be too much, but what is the best way? Is it email or is it phone call or is it Facebook in this current season for you? Which is the easiest way? Because, you know, I, I, I love the box, you know, but I don't want to mess up your uh, right, right now, probably email because yeah. Yeah. there's no – there's no telling where I am right during the week now, but um, you can always you know, even email. if even if I can't talk, I can still pop open an email right and, right uh, and see what's going on so so this is the reason why I'm sending you this is not because this email that I'm sending you right now it is called synchronization right uh uh with 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 an artist. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and so then I'm quality control. You see what I'm saying? So, yep. so because now is the time. I don't need any. I don't need anybody else to be a steward over this stuff. Because now I'm full time in the mix. In the mix. You know what I'm saying? And and so um and so you shut down Fifth Eye Music, but you need to do me a favor if you don't mind. And do this in your phone like you're talking to somebody, but don't talk to nobody. Talk it in your phone and then send it to me. And that is lessons learned from Fifth Eye Music. Okay. That's what, if you can give me, if you can give me about, you know, man, three, four hours while you just drive and you just record. And let the whale just open up. Let the whale open up on that insight about the, about the good practices and the bad practices of a record company. Because my record company, uh, and I say mine, that uh, uh, Space Jam Records picked me up as an artist. Right? But I'm his first artist, practically speaking. So we're working this thing the right way. but we're not going to just do it, you know, based on what they do on TV. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We I need Tony Woe region level insight. You are Tony Woe region. That means you, you, you at the top of the total pole, that means you passing down information. You ain't got to run around all the country. You put out a dispatch, a memo. <laughs> <laughs> And then I do the implementation. You see what I'm saying? That's the way it works. That's what you are. At, you you write down the executive order, and then I'm the one that takes and implements the executive order with my big mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and then eventually, eventually, somebody else will take my position. You know what I'm saying? So in, yep. so now in this stage, you can call it Tony World Region. I like it because it has name recognition. You know who it is. Yes, you can, baby. Go ahead. I, I, people need to know. And so I want you to accept that if you don't mind accepting it. But if you decide because you want to be more humble, which, you know, whatever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You come right. right you know, you know, whiteboard, whiteboard region. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> But Tony Wall region has a ring to it, and I want to keep that ring, if you don't mind. And I know you don't say it as much as you don't never say it. <laughs> so let me say it, okay? Let me be the John the Baptist, okay? And you just go ahead and let the dove hit you in the head, okay? <laughs> and let me baptize you, right. okay? Just let me do my John the Baptist stuff. You ain't got to understand everything. I'm the one that eats the locust leg. <laughs> and the wild honey walking around with a weird outfit on. You know what I'm saying? 
you take care of your business on the reason stuff. And, and, and I say that because, you, you know, you're supposed to see things from your level so that I can – because there's stuff that I just don't pay attention to because I'm doing my part. I so, uh, do we? Add, I mean, you, you understand what I'm saying. So you know, I'm not. I'm not trying to add to your plate now. You know, I'm not trying to add to your plate, sir. But I don't want to. Mm-hmm. I don't want you. To, I don't want you to pass on without passing on the insight. <laughs> we we need your wisdom. Like, you know, so finally, <laughs> finally, you know, we finally got your attention. The, the, the region, the district, finally got your attention. We need <laughs> insight from the regional. Think of yourself as a regional manager. Right. So do you feel do you feel your regional manager responsibility, sir? Do you feel it? <laughs> do you feel I listen? Know. I know you but listen, you gotta do it, sir. Somebody got to do it. I got district responsibility, okay? Right. <laughs> I got I got I got I got I got local, okay? You got federal. <laughs> when the feds, when the feds, look, 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 when the feds come in, local be like, all right, all right. <laughs> and I'm always about sending up for the feds to show up. Okay, when you in line, when you in line with the region, it works good. And that's the way, that's my military training. Okay, that's just what it is. So, sir, sir, are you prepared to handle this vessel that you've been handed by the kingdom of God, sir? Yeah, I'm do whatever he want me to do, man. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's the main, the main goal is just yeah. That. <laughs> Can you send me some more pictures? Do you got? Do you, have you done some photo shoots? You got some pictures? Some, some uh, nice yeah, pictures? I got a couple of them. Listen, send them to my email so I got some of them so I can start. Uh, because it's time. It's time, sir. Tony, whoa. You're not supposed to. You need a John the Baptist. You need a big mouth spreading the, spreading the word about that Tony Woe is coming. <laughs> Listen, and I know how to do it. I know how to do it. So, anyway, I'm proud of you. Thank you so much. Did you, did you, you haven't reached 40 yet. Now, you're still in your 30s, right? What? Man, I'll be 45 on June 3rd. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Did you say 45 on June 3rd? Yes, sir. Uh, what does the air feel like at 45, sir? What does the air feel like? Man, it feels heavenly because you know how it is, man. Everything, you know, people, ah. Uh, Man, you reach 30, you old, you're going to feel this way. You reach 35, you reach 40, you're going to feel this way. You're gonna feel, I feel the exact same way I did. I, well, actually, actually, I feel even better because I lost, uh, since I've been down here, I lost like three inches in the waist and two mm. in the belly. So, so I'm feeling oh. like I've been walking a mile and a half to work and back every day. And uh, hitting the gym a lot more regular. So when I go into 50, man, I'm going into 50 like I was like like back when I was in my 20s. So, Ooh. <laughs> you know, so it, it feels pretty good to me. I don't know how anybody else feels. But I tell you what, I'm hitting 45. Yeah. My youngest child is 17. So I, you about to empty nest that but oh you know it's exactly <laughs> he's he's going into uh he's a junior he's finishing up his junior year right now about to hit a senior he's super independent he mm. works he knows how to make his own money he's talented he's you know he he's i mean i ain't i ain't even worried about him so mm. i'm like i i'm it's man. I mean, I'm about to be an empty nester, bro. Yes. Congratulations <laughs> on the empty nest. Look, let me ask you a question. On the empty nest part, right, this this, okay, this, goes, this goes sound like a weird question now. Have mm-hmm. you embraced Have you embraced your grumpiness? My grumpiness? Your grumpiness. The, the, the part, listen, now, hear me out now. Hear me out. The grumpiness is, is, is not 
the grumpiness is not, uh, I'm not talking about grouch. I'm talking about grumpiness. I'm talking about Paul. I'm not working with John Mark or Mark Luke, whatever his name was. <laughs> <laughs> I have you embraced I'll... your grumpiness, the part of you that ain't, that don't put up with no mess. I, well, see, that's the problem with me is that that's always been around. I, it, it was <laughs> Jesus. It was Jesus that humbled me and showed me a better way than when I, because I grew up with one uh, thought in mind, my father instilled in me before, you know, we all came to Christ. It was the fault. It was the fact that the statement was more often than not, people will let you down. So yes. you don't, de- you don't depend on people for anything. Because they're just people, and that's mm-hmm. you know everybody's gonna make mistakes. Ever so, you know, it is, and so I know most of the time if something doesn't work, then you know I look at me like, okay, so what could have, what could I have done different? Right. You know, even though I may have done everything that I was supposed to do, and somebody else dropped the ball, and I'm like, see, okay, see. I got to I got to get better at picking people for my team though. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> you right. know, so it's right. uh I don't know, man, cuz this like right now uh with the exception of, you know, money being a little low, but you know how that is. Uh I feel great, bro. Mm-hmm. Everything is just I mean, I'm I'm down here you know in Florida. And everybody in Indiana is just now getting their temperatures where we've been for the last <laughs> <laughs> since January, you know. And we, uh, me and my wife was uh, yesterday, no, Saturday, uh, we went out and got another car. So I'm, I'm, I'm selling mine and, and I'm selling, well, we had two, so I'm selling one. And then we just picked up another one. Mm-hmm. It was, uh, we got a uh, 2012 Honda Genesis, and that sucker, <laughs> man, <laughs> boy, I'm like, I didn't know it was, I mean, it's like, you know, Genesis is uh, Honda's version of, like, a Lexus or something. Right. So it's like, it's like fully loaded, top of the line, everything. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. You know, everybody's like, oh, you need to get 2016 and 2017. I'm like, man, for everything that I want in it, you ain't going to be able to afford that. <laughs> I want something with, with every bell and whistle it can get. So we, we found one and didn't pay half of nothing for it. So, you know. Right. But, uh, yeah, I mean, just everything is great, man. I'm healthy. My wife's healthy. All my kids, my grandkids is healthy. So, you know. Mm-hmm. Forty-five yeah. is feeling great to me. Yeah, that is good stuff. That is good stuff. I'm I'm really happy for you, and I'm I'm actually uh, this. I really I'm grateful that we're talking in this season because um, my season is lined up to be a part of our synchronizing. Because I'm gonna tell you something. There's nothing. There, it felt so good. I I drove all the way to Atlanta and South Carolina, and I started one of my computers uh, broadcasting, you know, 24 hours a day. And when I hit the road, I was able to watch my show that I put on the thing just being streamed and then, you know, watch people chime in and, 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 and interact with them whenever I had time, whatever. And I was like, man, this is powerful stuff. I'm in another state, and my home computer is pushing out my content. Talk about automated. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm going to be doing for you is I'll be able to be sitting here at the house pushing out your content in a way that is very focused and very uh, practical in this new environment. If you are 
are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I show them. Faith Jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots Radio. If you are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I show them. Faith Jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots Radio. Who's a sent one? Use a sent one on a mission with the big guns. Did you know that? Full of this treasure. Measure your faith by endeavors. He didn't win his souls is considered clever. Whenever wisdom recounted him out, he surmounted the task and blasted it out the water. What is your name? Brother, you got favor. Fruit bearing tree got flavor. Introduce me to the savior. No holes in your game. Lifesaver. Broadcast the news. Dane Razor. Rather, I have a new perspective on matters. Old mindset's been shattered like glass. I used to be a pig boy, but now I'm out my slot, but now I'm rolling with the big boys. Put a mic in my hand and turn the volume to 10, and now testify across the land. If you are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I show them. Fake jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots Radio. If you are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I show them. Fake jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots Radio. I don't think they heard me, said I'm wordy, but this track is dirty. Had to turn and say, who's that? Rewind that jump back and turn it up and relax and intake. The mediator's monologue, subject matter, reconciliation, evangelism, living this thing. Not just talking like changling bang, no if ands, just butt kicking. What? Listen to the liver sister, he can give you words of lies. Girl, sister, try to issue slurs and blind. But play at any times, I'm the church you find. Bumping my sounds, bald head, thinking the rounds. Stopping the ground, in prayer, putting it down. You're supposed to be opposed to be the green light to go to. To enlist the soldier, rev your motor skills. It'll be no tiss to build when their hope gets filled. By your living water geyser, tap with the spigot. Your homie, let's kick it, just hop in the ride. Building a rapport, asking what they on the earth for. Open up the door for. If you are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I'll show them. Faith Jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots Radio. If you are in need of the sun, I know them. If you are looking for the sun, I'll show them. Faith Jam is now in demand, so let's go. M3 Dots. M3 Who's battling for fattest beat? Battling rapid and fat and fattest speech. Homer, please. God could bring a G to his knees with the sneeze. Then heal his venereal disease and the breeze. Give him eternal last and eternal peace. And make him wise and then the doctor would agree. Jesus is the bomb digger. Who's bigger? I'd rather be employed by your master builder. Always on the move. Even if I'm exiled, I'm building lies while you're trying to build your empire. Your verses need texture, not empty lyricism over empty rhythms. When the spirit is moving, you can be in tune and sync like God's image. Faith Jam Records, M3 Dots Radio. It's easy for you to know them. It's easy for you to know them.